Hello everyone. Welcome to day three of the 10 minute portrait challenge. I just finished a, a Zoom session with Mark and Rachel and we were hanging out, sketching each other. It was, um, it was great fun, just the three of us. So very cozy and we had a, a really fun storyline and a great chat about uh, social media and creativity and whether, we, whether and how we choose to present ourselves or not. And um, it was great. Uh, it's such good practice. And it was really lovely hanging out with Mark and Rachel. So thank you both for joining me. <gasps> Mark is here. Hello, Mark. Um, and there are a few other people here. I'd love you to say hello in the chat. And we are about to start sketching. Um, Shubha Mukta today, we are focusing on, on musicians and um, Shubha Mukta is a, has an incredible voice, um, so the Indian classical singer and um, there's a link in the description below if you would like to um, have a listen and um, yeah, we'll start drawing 10 minute portrait. I have some, some walnut ink and I have my um, What's it called? Uh, parallel pen. It's a really broad nib pen. And I think it's going to lend itself nicely to this profile. And there's some really, um, I think the play of black and the walnut ink is going to be really interesting. So we'll get into that. I'll put my timer on. And hi, 81 Tizzle. And we will do our 10 minute portrait. Let's do it. Um, and let me know in the chat what you're working with. Um, and if you're sharing, um, if you're posting your work, I, I'd love to see it. So you can use the hashtags and tag me. And also, uh, Shubha Mugda has an Instagram account. Don't know if she'll see it, but um, feel free to tag them as well. Um, yeah, so for those of you who have not been here for the, um, the t 10 minute portrait challenge thus far, or for those of you who have, it's, it's so great ha having you all here. The idea behind this is that we, um, with a relatively short amount of time, um, can can practice and that cumulatively that, that practice and drawing many different faces and just getting into a habit of, um, of practicing something doable, uh, I think t 10 minutes for, for most of us. Uh, we may be able to find t 10 minutes to, to draw. And um, yeah, I, I think it's a fun way to, to just sketch a whole bunch of different people and to do it together. It's really nice. And yeah, so we just had the Zoom session, um, which is my favorite way of drawing together with people because it's so nice that we get to we hang out and talk to each other and we give each other prompts. And it's a super fun way to um, to draw together. <gasps> cool. Happy birthday, Cristobal. Um, brush pen. That sounds awesome. A good a good birthday present. Was it a, a, a gift from yourself, or did someone give give you this brush pen? It's interesting doing a such a strong profile um, and going straight in with ink like you either you get it or you don't um, but just by um, sometimes just even like with a profile just that that first like that w one contour um, you know it can be such such a a simple, elegant kind of line, and I feel like the likeness is a bit off. And since I don't know where, we'll just go with it and build upon it, and perhaps we will create a a new um, Shubha Mukta. Cool, yeah. So um, have fun with your brush pen. I. Once I start, when I started getting into ink, my my first ink um, tool was a brush pen, and it was a really um, 
really enjoyed uh, exploring line variation with it. So that's, that's really cool. Um, this is a, a walnut ink that I made from walnut husks. You could also fill it into a brush pen if you filter the ink. You can see there's some little like particles and stuff. I, I tend not to really filter my my ink super clear, um, but you can you can you can filter your your natural inks so that they um, they don't block your pens and stuff. But I tend to use it straight from the, either with a, a brush or a stick pen. I think just playing the tanpura here, which is an incredible drone instrument. I love it. I was um, mentioned yesterday um, that when I started listening to some Indian classical music in the beginning, it was like for my ear, it was like such a different thing, and that. It took me a bit of listening to kind of, I don't know if I understood what I was listening to, but there's, um, I, I think a lot of music which uh, which kind of plays with a drone and the tampura is this wonderful like drone instrument. Um, and then the, if you, you check out the video that I, I posted below, like the, the, the possibility for playing upon um, like creating these layers of sound and just like singing, uh, singing with a drone sound, I, I think is uh, really so cool. Like it's cool to try it yourself and it can be like the hum of a refrigerator and like singing along to it or um, a really a beautiful instrument like a tampura. My side, Chris. Is it is it lunchtime? Is anyone here watching, joining from their lunch break? We're about halfway. I think yesterday we had some people uh, drawing along during their lunch break. I actually thought this would be a good time for people in Australia to watch. Um, I've had some Australians saying it's it's like it's too late. Maybe I just um, I go to sleep later than I should, <laughs> and um, and I guess other people go to bed earlier. <laughs> Last night we had a really awesome conversation with Janelle Janelle Bernard drawn together. You can watch the replay on my YouTube channel, and. Um, we had a two hour conversation uh, about creativity, being a muse, um, the creative process of being being an art model. Um, Janelle does really like put so much care into uh, and love into the story and the looks and the ideas that she poses with. Um, and she does really incredible um, self-portraits that she shares for people to draw from. Um, so that was great. And the chat went on for two hours. And then by the time I got to bed, it was midnight. And, uh... I'm, I haven't planned it yet, but um because we're on the, the topic of musicians and I've been taking requests who people think it would be cool to draw. Um, tomorrow would be the bi-weekly rhythm for, um, for doing a longer 10 minute portrait session. Uh, the past couple months, every second Saturday, I've done a 10 minute portrait live stream session where we do 10 portraits in two hours. And, um, so I've got quite a list of musicians, um, the people that I want to draw and the, all the suggestions I've been collecting from you. And um, so if I get that set up, maybe tomorrow we'll be doing a, a big 10 minute portrait session. Um, I'm gonna grab a brush for these bigger areas of darkness. Um, 
the neck of the tanpura and the hair. I can just um, block that in much more effectively with the brush. I love the, the line variety, the variation with the um, parallel pen, but for really big, clear areas of, of darkness, it's, it's so much more efficient and fast to use a brush. So um, yeah, keep, keep your suggestions coming. Um, so I, I have a lot of musicians that have inspired me who I'm really looking forward to drawing and, and you've had some great suggestions as well. So um, let me know, let me know who you'd like to, to draw. Hi, Angela. Yeah, wasn't it, wasn't it great, the talk yesterday? I'm so glad that you were there, 81 Tizzle. It's, it's really been lovely seeing the, the work, the portraits that people did, the drawings of Janelle. I know that Janelle has been, um, I mentioned yesterday, has been drawn on the sketchy app alone, almost uh, 4,000 portraits of Janelle and, and she's posed in lots of um, life drawing sessions. And so who knows how many thousand times Janelle has been drawn. And it was so nice to have, yeah, have a chat and to hear from her perspective as a as a muse, as a model, um, what, oh, that's too wet. What goes into it for her? And, and she's just so lovely. So thank you to those who joined live. Chatting with Janelle. That's it, 10 minutes. Cool. How did everyone go with your 10 minute portrait? That's it for today. And um, you could watch the, if you're uh, watching this at a later date, um, and if you're interested, you can watch the replays as well. And, or if you're just, just joining, you can check out the last couple and also in the past months. Um, I've, I've done quite a few 10 minute portrait live streams and yeah, it's really great practice. And, and I wonder something I've been wondering about a lot recently is like, what is it, what is it leading towards? Um, it's really great doing all this practice. I was just talking with Mark in our, our zoom session. Um, like at some point it's nice to, you know, head on to some, something a bit longer to spend some more time with the piece and. Yeah, and I really want to be curious to hear from you. How, how is this 10 minute portrait practice for you? And what would you like to, to focus on and develop? And if there are any aspirations that you have. But for now, I'm just super happy to have you here along for the 10 minute portrait ride. Um, stay tuned. If you're not already, like and subscribe. Uh, I'd love you to leave a comment and any suggestions you have for musicians that we should draw. I'd love to hear it. And um, yeah, stay tuned because perhaps tomorrow night we'll be doing a longer live stream where we'll do a bunch of um, portraits of musicians. So um, that's how this one turned out today of Shubha Mukdal. Um, really incredible music. I feel like the, the genre of Indian classical music, it's something to take some time to to get into because it's like it's like a journey it's not like um bubblegum pop uh it's like some of these songs are like 20 minutes long and it's really um so it's, for me it's been like de developing such a different way of listening to music as well and it's um it's like a, yeah it's super interesting so thank you very much to shupa mukta for all the amazing music you make thank you to all of you for being here and drawing together and I look forward to sketching with you again tomorrow. Um, if there are any questions, now would be the time to ask them. If not, enjoy the rest of your day and be sure to check back, check out my Instagram, tag me. I'd love to reshare the sketches that you do um, and have a look on Instagram because that's the place where I'll be saying, hey, Saturday, this is what we're gonna do. Um, so keep in touch and let me know your suggestions of who we should draw together. And thank you so much for being here. Um, See you tomorrow.